everybody, welcome to the Bedhead Blog. Um, thanks for stopping by. If, uh, if you've been by channelchris.com recently, I appreciate that. Um, this, I got a couple things I want to talk to you about today. One is, uh, this is your average run-of-the-mill everyday applause sign. You guys are probably pretty familiar with one. I, th I think probably most people have them in their house. Um, so when you see this light up, go ahead and applaud if you'd like. In fact, even if you don't want to applaud, go ahead and applaud. So, uh, welcome to the show. It's not even a show. <clears throat> anyway, so the first thing I want to talk to you about besides this, so it's really the second thing I want to talk to you about, is microwaves. Okay. You put something in the microwave, you put your little time, one minute or whatever, and then you press start, and your microwave goes. If you have one of those trays that spins around, it and cook, you're cooking your thing. When it gets down to the end of time, so it's like three, three, two, one, it goes beep, 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 and it's done. Every time that it hits zero, it wants to let you know that it's no longer cooking. So it goes beep, beep, beep. So that it really annoys me. So if I'm near the microwave, as soon as I hear it go beep the first time, I open the door so that it will stop beeping. But the microwave that I have doesn't stop beeping. So it says three, two, one, beep, open the door, beep, beep. I know that the darn thing is finished. I opened the door, didn't I? You know, when you're, when you're cooking something in the microwave and you just, let's say, you put it to 30 seconds, right? And it gets down to 20 and you press, you know, open the door or whatever, it stops working because it knows you open the dang door. So the, the, the microwave knows when you open the door and don't open it. So why doesn't it stop beeping when you, when you anyway, that's a huge issue uh, with the manufacturing. This is a big flaw, okay? Probably it's one of the major reasons why we're having such trouble with the economy today is because these damn microwaves are beeping like that. You know, you can call, you can blame it on the subprime mortgage, but I think, are you with me on this? Yeah, there you go. Applaud. Secondly, um, as a lot of you may know, there is a presidential, presidential election going on, right? Um, and what you're basically seeing out there is that Obama's winning and McCain is losing um, because, pretty much because McCain and the Republicans have had their shot and McCain's, uh, you know, great guy, respect a lot about him, except for the fact that he's kind of a little old to be running for president. Um, no offense to all you old people out there. You keep plugging away and doing your thing. Um, it's just, uh, he just seems like he kind of half cares. You know, he doesn't seem like a vibrant, crazy running person running for, uh, for president. Although he's picked up recently because what's going on right now, since he's losing, is what the Republicans are brilliant at is like the smear campaign and uh, personal attacks, uh, all kinds of attacks and bullshit like that. So, American people, um, I hope that you're smart enough to see the bullshit uh, in the campaigning. And uh, everyone's, you know, they're all guilty of it, Republicans and Democrats. Republicans just seem to be a little better at it and a little, they seem to be able to do it without, with a clear conscience, those sons of bitches. Anyway, uh, if you're a Republican, honestly, I really, I, I mean all the offense that I possibly can. So don't take it the wrong way. If you're a Republican, like I said, um, I, 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 mean, I, I mean to offend you. So just don't take it personally. Um, and that's about it, I guess. Later, USA.